It was not my fault. I barely consumed my body weight in that toxic liquid. Hey, I was surrounded by adoring fans. I couldn't let them go thirsty. Oh, I don't care who ordered all the drinks. We need to figure out how to pay our tab. Pete's gonna love my solution. You know I always got genius ideas, right? You need a plan, you go to Rocket. That's the deal. I'm just making good on it. Yeah, whatever it is, I'm sure it's brilliant. Why, thank you. It certainly is. We're gonna sell Thanos' body! I am That is not a bad idea. Selling a corpse? How could that be profitable? There are people who would find it valuable. Exactly. And I know just the guy. The Collector. He loves buying exotic crap for his museum, so Thanos, the newly dead Titan, will be perfect. He'll pay you tons of units for that body. These are the kind of people you want to be rubbing elbows with, Pete. Everything they got's a superlative. The biggest this, the best that, the fastest the other thing. Uh, okay, well that is... that is very weird. You got this purple freak laying dead in front of you, a tree puking his guts out in your toilet, and this is the weird thing? Look around you! Weird is the new normal! Or... we could turn Thanos over to the Nova Corps. They've had an official bounty on his head for years. Plus, it comes with the added benefit of not having to deal with criminals, like the Collector. He's a corrupt thug, bottom line. But the Nova Corps, they maintain peace and order in the galaxy. They have thousands of ships and soldiers. This could get us on their good side. Yeah, turning Thanos over to the Nova Corps sounds right. Thank you, Peter. You guys, you're killing me with this. We'd make way more money with the Collector. You're being a greedy little rodent right oh, now. Oh, as if you're so high and mighty, green lady. You suddenly forgot all the innocent people you murdered for that psycho? I remember each and every one. Not that you'd understand. You do whatever the hell you want, whenever you want. That is an accurate and completely acceptable judgment. Hey, Rocket, cut it out. Way too far. You kidding me with this, Pete? This is why I need a friggin' break! It's Peter's call, Rocket. Not yours. Enjoy staring at my furry backside, chumps. You, uh, doing all right after last night? The Roden tried to deny me my victory. But you, my true and noble friend, Peter Quill, stood with me. I believe Hovat and Camaria can rest peacefully now. I really need to figure out what to do with Thanos. Novacor, Collector, thrown into a black hole? That is up to you. He is dead. That is all I care about. You know, I've never asked. Hovat and Camaria. What were they like? My wife and daughter. They were... kind. Brave. True. Qualities I, myself, aspire to possess. Ask me no more of them, Peter. I do not always wish to remember their faces. So, eating your feelings, I see. With Thanos defeated, there is a void inside of me that only these rations can fill. All right, gotta run, Drax. Stay cool. My body temperature is always 125.9 degrees. Hey, Mom. Ah, oh, missed that view. <laughs> Had this bag since I was a kid. Used to hold candy. Now it holds... Well, now it holds alien candy.
I always knew I'd make headlines someday. Just didn't think it'd be for killing a giant purple tyrant. Well, that's not good. Who did? You did. And about to be someone else's problem. That terminal took a beating in the crash. Still offline. Gotta use the one on the bridge. You come to make amends? No, I'm not. You were being a jerk. Well, I can be a jerk all by myself. So leave me alone, jerk. And don't be an idiot. Thanos is worth a fortune. Call the Collector. This is just you and me now, Nebula. We should... I don't know. Catch up? About what, Gamora? How you killed our father? You left us no Stay choice. Stay away from me. <sighs> hey, Peter. How are you doing? Fine. Staying as far away from Rocket as I can. Uh, I don't want to let him ruin my mood. Last night was actually fun. Ah, uh, maybe too much fun. So, something on your mind? Did I hear you talking to Nebula earlier? Ugh. If by talking to, you mean being yelled at. Ah, <sighs> even though she's pissed, it feels good to have it off my mind. Thanks for the advice. Hey, what are friends for? <laughs> Stopping one another from drinking too much. We both failed that mission. So... Still mad at Rocket? He needs to watch his little tongue. I... may have been too harsh with him. He just... oh, he's so infuriating. Why do you like the Nova Corps so much? I don't... really like to talk about it, but... I was an assassin. For Thanos. I killed so many people for him that I lost count. Tyrants. Innocence. <sighs> Didn't matter. If you ever hear the ridiculous nickname, the most dangerous woman in the universe, that was me. But the Nova Corps, they turned a blind eye to my past after I joined the Guardians. Being with you guys? Making the galaxy safer, it's my chance to make up for what I did. I guess I'll talk to you later. Some advice for you. Don't trust the Collector. You should call the Nova Corps.
Okay. Novacor. Star-Lord? We thought you were dead. How the hell did you survive? Hardly any of our soldiers made it out. Our fleet was wiped out. What can I say? I'm a tough guy to kill. <laughs> I should have known Thanos couldn't take you out. Yeah, speaking of which, I have something you might be interested in. I got Thanos lying right here. Really dead. Smelling up the place. Now, I understand there's some kind of bounty on him. Is that right? You have his body? <laughs> I can't believe it. We'll dispatch some officers to your location. Novacor out. What? We could have gotten way more units with the Collector. What were you thinking, Pete? I rolled out the red carpet for you, and you took a friggin' nosedive. Oi, I should have just sold them myself. We need strong allies, not some body displayed in a museum, okay? It's wrong. And weird. That's two W words, and that proves my point. Whatever. There. A third one for your stupid list. I am Groot. Groot says you did the right thing. Yada, yada, yada. I say we totally missed out on a big score. Thank you, Groot. Shut up, Rocket. Fine. You want to suck up to the space cops? Be my guest. But I ain't going with you. Calm down, Rocket. Look, how about we throw in that relic? That'll give us a little extra. <laughs> I guess. Every little bit helps. Oh, come on. Where did I put that thing? Found you. I'm gonna kill him. Ugh. She broke it, Mom. That doesn't mean it was okay to hit that boy. Violence isn't the answer to every problem. Are you listening to me? Nothing wrong with punching a bully. He deserved it. You know what? He did. But it's not taking the high road if you're using your fists. You gave me this for my birthday. I mean, you should be pissed <laughs> off too. <clears throat> And what he did was wrong, but... But you, you don't just go punching every person who makes you mad. Especially not someone who's three grades above you. I mean, that kid practically shaves. <laughs> and three years from now, we'll be in the same grade. <laughs> Very funny. This can't keep happening, Peter. I know I haven't been home as much lately, but that's all the more reason I need you to step up and take some responsibility. I know. Then you know tomorrow you're apologizing to that boy. And I mean a real apology. No smart Alex stuff. Okay, fine. But this is so unfair. <laughs> Newsflash, kiddo. Life's not always fair. What matters is you do what's right. <sighs> I think we could both use a chance to clear our heads, don't you? What we need is a little perspective. Sometimes it takes stepping back from your problems to see how small they actually are. Beautiful. <coughs> These last few months haven't been easy. For either of us. But, um... I'm not always gonna be here. I worry about you. You're growing up so fast. Don't worry about me, Mom. I'll never stop worrying about you. You're gonna be around long after I'm gone. I just don't want you to be alone. Mom? 
I'm <coughs> fine, baby. It's nothing. <clears throat> it's just the dust. I know you've got a lot on your mind. But that kid you fought, maybe he does too. Promise me in the future you'll use your words instead of your fists. I will, Mom. I promise. Thank you, baby. You fixed it! Hell! What can I say, huh? I'm pretty good. Hey, oh, great song. Someone with exceptional taste must have introduced you to this one. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay? You've just been standing there, talking to this thing. That was incredibly weird. What was weird? I'm not really sure. It's been hours. Hours? The Nova Corps are here. Okay. Uh, yeah. You look like you just saw a ghost. Something isn't right. I... I really don't know what I just saw. When I grabbed the relic, I... I was suddenly back on Earth. And my... Mom was there. Peter? Your mother is dead. I know, I, I know, I know she is. I just... Somehow, it didn't feel that way. <sighs> we can't keep the Nova Corps waiting. But I do not trust this thing. No way we're selling it. All right. Showtime. Let's go. Thank you, Guardians, for bringing Thanos' body straight to us. We know the Collector was quite interested in purchasing his remains. Probably to put in that hellish zoo of his. But we will dispose of the body properly. There should be no trace left anywhere in the universe of Thanos the Mad Titan. Well, sometimes you have to do the right thing. No matter how difficult and dangerous and noble it is. The galaxy is in your debt, Star-Lord, as are we. Once we have verified Thanos' corpse, the bounty is yours. While we're here, I've just got to say, I'm a big fan of yours, Star-Lord. You took out the Mad Titan. No one else could have done this. I've been following your adventures for years. <laughs> your time with Yondu and the Ravagers, forming the Guardians of the Galaxy. You lead a legendary life. <laughs> wow. Well, thanks. You're welcome. You know, we're fans of the Nova Corps, too. Don't mind him. Confirmed. Thanos the Mad Titan. Great. We'll take that bounty now, Space Cop. Oh, of course. 
Okay. Once the body has been received by processing, the bounty will be released to accounting. You should start receiving your payment in installments in... six to twelve months. Ugh, I know. Standard protocol. And there's a lot of red tape and paperwork to go through. I, I wish we could pay you sooner. Oh, come on, man. Help me out here. I mean, can't my biggest fan speed things up a little? Well, <laughs> um, I might be able to pull some strings. But, um, in return, I, I, I have a small favor to ask. Just, like, tiny, tiny favor. Uh. Can I, um, <clears throat> um, touch your gun? I, I've always wanted to. It is legendary. Uh, let's not make this weird. Oh, oh, oh no, no, I, I didn't mean to make it weird. Mm, I am Groot. Yeah, he says it's very weird. And we're all done here. It's been an honor working with you, Star-Lord. Peter Quill. Oh, what now? You have something I desire. The Eternity Forge. All right. The body will be taken to the facility. Oh my god! Whoa! And since Jinzar could not retrieve it earlier, I must take it myself. I will not fail you again, Hala. <gasps> Retrieve the relic. Can you actually shoot? Speak, kid. Is that a yes? Ah, just follow me. So incredible! Woo! <laughs> How do you like that? Ow! Hey! Get the hell off! Mine. Ugh. No, no, hey, hey. We have what we came for. We need the ship! The engines are down! It's gonna take a minute! We can't wait! They're getting away! I'm coming with you. There's only one pack. Allow me to fight beside you, Star-Lord. I killed Thanos. I can kill some measly blue warriors. The size of that warship. You can't fight your way through that. Take me, and they'll never even know we were there. Let us paint her ship red with blood from the inside. The fewer people who detect us, the better. 
You've seen the types of weapons they possess. I welcome the confrontation. Gamora, you're with me. As you wish. Kill all the Kree for me, Star-Lord. If you do not, I shall never forgive you. It's Kree, commanded by someone named Hala the Accuser. Kree? But their planet was destroyed. I thought they were extinct. You ain't wrong. That ship, those people, shouldn't exist. Well, I'm looking right at it. Right behind you. Gamora! <sighs> Thanks. Anytime. <sighs> Looks clear. Let's get moving. You've been acting strange ever since I found you with that relic. Now you go flying off after a Kree warship? Is this about that dream you had? I... I don't understand. What aren't you telling me? Look, to be honest with you, I'm not so sure it was a dream. I was back home. It felt so real. My mom told me to come find her. That's not possible, Peter. She's buried on Earth. We don't know what this thing is. It could be affecting you. Honestly, I'm just as confused as you are. Confusion or not, that relic is dangerous. Who knows what else it's capable of? Look, we just need to get the relic back. All right, Peter. Whatever you say. Rocket, how are the engines looking? Not great, Pete. The old girl's seen better days. Hey, Groot, don't stick your roots in that. Hey, Drex. Peter, is the slaughter glorious over there? Spare no gruesome detail. I haven't run into anyone yet. Oh, good. I am less envious now. Those are pictures of... This is more tomb than warship. And we're sure they're actually really dead, right? The Kree are a technologically advanced species, but science cannot defeat death. Those glyphs are Kree. 
but I can't make out what it says. I can. Much better. 100% of Stasis pods online. Ship performing at 6% crew efficiency. That... is a lot of dead folks. The bridge. hala has gotta be there. Which means, that's where the relic is. Hala would be expecting a direct attack. We need to find a way in there without being seen. Power diverted to access way. 36 stasis pods now offline. Equilibrium terminated. Uh, whoa. My bad. We can't get any deader, I guess. Hey, Kamora. I'm game if you are. Perfect. Lead the way. Keep moving and stay quiet. Oh, you're the one who's talking. Shh, what did I just say? Deactivated the stasis pods. I'm your weapons. We must find them. They cannot be far. Keep moving. Did you hear that? Move! At the end of the corridor, be swift! 